ISTs are organizers. I also have a Twitch channel. Head on over there for more roleplay advice and other fun stuff. Spare Room with Karen Terry. Hey y'all, and welcome to Spare Room. I'm Karen Terry, and today we're going to talk about ISTJs and ISTPs. Yes, this is another MBTI Types video. If you missed the first one, I will link it up in the card. It goes over an introduction to MBTI, as well as the history of MBTI. We're going to talk about the two IST types. And remember, MBTI is primarily a workplace tool, so you can use it to figure out how a character acts, reacts, makes decisions, and what they notice in their environment. The first letter of your MBTI type is either E for extroversion or I for introversion. This is your favorite world. Do you prefer to focus on your outer world or your inner world? Those who prefer introversion expend energy through action. They prefer to act, then reflect, then act again. To rebuild their energy, introverts need quiet time alone, away from activity. The second letter is either S for sensing or N for intuition. This defines how you process information. Do you prefer to focus on the basic information you take in, or do you prefer to interpret information and add meaning? Those who prefer sensing are more likely to trust information that's right in front of them or can be shown to them in some way. They trust the present, tangible, and concrete, aka information that can be understood by the five senses. The third letter is either T for thinking or F for feeling. This is how you make decisions. Do you first look at logic and consistency, or do you first look at people in special circumstances? Those who prefer thinking tend to decide things from a more detached standpoint. They measure decisions by what seems reasonable, logical, causal, and consistent, and also what matches a given set of rules. ISTs are organizers. They use their sensing to get their hands dirty with what's going on around them and who they're involved with. They take what they sense and use thinking to organize it logically. Then they examine these things in their inner world to come to practical conclusions. The difference between these types is the last letter, either J for judging or P for perceiving. This is how you deal with the outside world. Do you prefer to decide things or do you prefer to stay open to new information? ISTJs are known as coordinators. Those who prefer judging feel most comfortable when they have a plan, and they'd rather come up with five backup plans than deal with the events as they come, preferring to consider their options ahead of time. Personality types with this trait prefer clarity and closure, sticking with the plan rather than going with the flow. Combine this with their IST nature of being organizers, and this means when ISTJs say they're gonna do something, they always follow through with their plans. Coordinators are honest, responsible, calm, practical, organized, direct, and strong-willed. But they're also stubborn, insensitive, inflexible, judgmental, and take too much on by themselves. MBTI was developed for the workplace, so let's see how ISTJs handle their careers. ISTJs are looking to build long-term, stable careers. They crave dependability, clear tasks and duties, and a proven tradition. They do best when a career utilizes their dependability, objectivity, and sharp eye which they use to get any task done. They prefer to work alone, only utilizing a team when necessary. For example, having a manager help them set up clear goals or having a partner where tasks are equally divided. And then they both go to work on the tasks separately. Those are the best type of team dynamics for an ISTJ. They may struggle in jobs that expect them to network or do other social tasks. You won't find ISTJs hanging out at the water cooler or going to lunch with their colleagues. And you probably don't want them to. They are very facts-oriented and not so good at sensing others' feelings. So careers that require an emotional investment will not work for ISTJs. They make great judges, military leaders, managers, police officers, detectives, attorneys, accountants, and business executives. ISTPs are known as virtuosos. Those who prefer perceiving are much more flexible when it comes to dealing with unexpected challenges. 
This flexibility helps them seize unexpected opportunities as well. These personality types tend to react to their environments rather than try to control them, helping them to make their own luck in whatever the world delivers. People with this trait hold that life is full of possibilities. Combine this with their IST nature of being organizers, and that means ISTPs need to get their hands dirty in whatever project they're working on. Virtuosos are optimistic, energetic, practical, creative, relaxed, and rational. But they're also private, reserved, easily bored, won't commit, risky, and insensitive. MBTI was developed for the workplace, so let's see how ISTPs handle their careers. ISTPs thrive on complex problems and a sense of what's next. They are born problem solvers with an unwavering focus on practical solutions. No other type is quite as fascinated by how things work, how tools can be used, and how facts can be put together to create satisfying results. Nearly anything creative or constructive is a good fit for ISTPs. If they can get their hands on it and work alone to see the project through, they're happy. ISTPs may struggle in careers that require them to think carefully or discourage them from taking risks. They may also struggle if they're tasked with leading a team of people where that team is actually the ones getting their hands on the project. Since they can't resist getting their hands dirty, they may end up doing the work that their team is supposed to be doing instead of leading their team to do the work themselves. They make great detectives, forensic pathologists, engineers, construction workers, mechanics, farmers, pilots, or athletes. ISTJs and ISTPs both thrive in logical, organized environments. Where they differ is that ISTJs need clear rules and hierarchy to complete their tasks. And ISTPs need to get their hands on that task themselves and preferably work alone without others bothering them. So that's ISTJs and ISTPs. Do you have any IST characters? Let me know all about them down below. And if not, after watching this video, are you considering making one? Let me know about that as well. And of course, as always, don't forget to make it a great day.